Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm just on my way out to the barn here. Uh, after grabbing some quick lunch, uh, we were getting uh, all of the grass raked up and everything. So I got the baler hooked up and we're going to head out and do some baling. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. As always, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below. Let me know what you think of this series. I think we'll start with the uh, grass bales down the road there. That uh, I raked up off screen. So we'll get on down there. Don't do it. I had a feeling that car was going to pull out in front of me there. So we got this field all raked up off screen. Uh, I need to switch my bale size. So we're going to be doing a little bit bigger bales. Now that we have, I'm going to buy a wrapper. Hopefully this episode that does 180 centimeter bales. So we need to change our size to 180, like so. We shall get to work. I don't know why my HUD turned off, that was interesting. That bale's gonna be 150 because that's what it was last time. Now we should be making 180 bales. So uh, financially, we're not doing too bad. Um, we're about sixty-eight thousand dollars. Hopefully, the, the um, crops we can bring in next year, the soybeans and the corn. Hopefully, some of that cash will come in then. But uh, as of right now, I don't think we we don't have any loans. I don't think, unless I took some out last time. Nope, we don't have any loans. So we're just going to keep trucking along here, and we'll catch up with you when we get done with the field.
there we go. That field is all done. We are going to move up to Hayfield. I also do have some new textures on this map. Um, I'm planning on updating the corn texture because I, from what I've seen, it's not that great. So when it comes to harvest time, so I'm probably going to update that. But uh, we'll get into this hay field here. We'll see how many bales we can kick out of this field. Which is probably about the same size, just a little bit of a different shape. So, Alright, here we go. Hopefully this switches to hay before. Yep, it pumps out. Um, we're going to till this up this fall. I just need to find a plow. I do not have one yet. I don't think. I may have bought one. I'm not sure. But we will be buying a plow for sure. And we will be tilling this up. Or buying a piece of tillage equipment. In general. And we'll be tilling this up. So we can actually fertilize it. Lime it. And maybe get a little bit more hay out of it. Or grass or whatever crops we decide to plant in here. So if you guys are enjoying the video. Make sure you like. Subscribe. Comment down below, let me know what you think of the series, and we're going to keep working on this field, and we'll see you when we get done. Just finishing up the field here and we're probably gonna get this back to the farm and then we'll uh, grab the bale trailer we'll go around and pick up uh, most of the bales and might uh, actually get that wrapper first and go wrap those uh, grass bales probably a better idea thing is that we're gonna turn those into silage so that cows have something to eat over the winter time so we will reset our points. We're going to do this realistically. We're going to go in here. We're going to get bale wrapper. Go this one. This is a new bale wrapper. Should be good for us. We will head up to... I was also thinking about getting a feed mixer too. How much is the feed mixer that I would like to get? So we could get that one. I don't think I have any others in here. Nope. So we could get this one. I think all you need is silage and hay, so we could technically that this is only $29,000. I'd say let's do it. Why not? 
we can sell some of these hay bales too if we need to. I don't think we'll need to since we'll have probably milk coming in soon. And we won't need to buy fertilizer because we'll have manure and slurry to spread on our fields. So we won't need much fertilizer. So we will head up here to the shop. We'll grab our uh, bale wrapper. We'll go wrap those bales up. Probably give the cows a hay bale or something. If they don't already have one in there. How are they doing anyway? So yeah, they're good on hay. They'll be good for a little while. And they're also good, so... We'll come back for that feed mixer. But we'll take this back to the farm. We'll take it up to the field, actually. Since we have it hooked up. And we... Um... Since we gotta go this way anyway, we might as well just take it right to the field. Instead of driving into the farm and then having to come back out the same way we just went in, we'll just take it directly to the field and get wrapping. I kind of wish you could wrap hay bales in this game. Not gonna lie. kind of wish that was a thing. Because I think farmers in real life do it. I think they wrap hay. But I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that, because I could be wrong. If there's any real farmers out there watching the channel, let me know in the comments. Do you guys, or any dairy farmers, I should say, um, or regular farmers, if you do hay and stuff, do you guys wrap your hay bales for silage bales, or is it just straight up grass? You don't let it dry out, it's got moisture in it. If there's any farmers out there watching the channel, I'd love to hear it in the comments. But I know for the game, we just have our silage bales that come from the grass bales, so. This thing wraps really fast, too. It's one of the things I like about it. Okay. Get these all wrapped, and then we'll come pick them up. Let's hook up the trailer to this tractor, and we will keep pounding away at this. Sorry if I'm not talking much today in today's video. I just had a long day. It's been uh, a tiring, tiring start to the week here, so... I'm trying my best. Videos will be Tuesday through Thursday now, sometimes Friday. The occasional upload on Friday. But for now, the schedule that works good for me is Tuesday through Thursday. So that's four days out of the week. I just don't have the time on Mondays or Thursday nights to record and get it uploaded for the the next day because I I record the videos the night before when I have time and then I re then I upload them at night before I go off to bed and stuff so we'll get this back to the farm enough uh, me ranting on about doing stuff about the videos but we'll just we're gonna cut through here We'll grab the bale trailer. We'll get, I think we'll pick up the hay bales first. We should probably give the cows something to eat. We'll put that there for now. Actually, the cows don't need anything right now, so we can just grab the bale trailer, which is over here. We'll hook up to this. We'll go over to the hay field and we'll pick up all these bales first since they're closer. I think I'll do this and I will see you guys when we get into some cow feeding this winter. 
with the new mixer. Alrighty, I am on my way up to the shop to pick up our new feed mixer because our cows are in need of some food and I'm pretty sure that our silage has been fermented. If not, we'll buy a couple bales because I gotta buy straw anyway. And yes, I bet you're thinking, Polecat, why didn't you pick up the feed mixer before, uh, before you uh, actually had to feed? Uh, well, because I kind of forgot. Yep. So, we have it now. We are going to take it back to the farm. We're going to get these cows fed. I think uh, the ones out in the pasture will probably just feed direct silage. And then we'll mix it together to make a total mixed ration for the dairy cows. I think is our feed plan. It sounds pretty decent to me. So we will get this back to the farm. Here's the farm. I need to put a mailbox out here. That's another thing I need to do. I got a mailbox mod in here. And I gotta put a mailbox at the end of the driveway. Okay. So, let's, uh... I need another tractor around here. Is this fermented? Oh, it's almost there. Okay, so I think we'll just take the cows, a small hay bale. It should last until tomorrow. They should last until tomorrow, but I just want to be sure that they're not going to run out of food, because if they run out of food, they die. I don't know if I'll edit that part out or not, but... Excuse me, cow. There we go. Right, that should be good for them for a few days. They'll munch on that. Should add the animal grazing mod into here. And get Maze Plus installed too, and then we can... They can graze on the pastures during the summer. Okay, so they're good. These guys should be good. I just need one more day because of silage. Is this a silage bale? Is this one? No, same one. Same thing. It's 93, so... We shall park this tractor... in here. I would also like to see how much this little Massey Ferguson is, or I think it's a Massey, yeah. This little one. Is there, I think there's a special loader that goes with it, but that's an expensive tractor. But maybe eventually we can buy that and get it, um, let's see. Let's go back over here. Uh, I'm gonna sleep. We'll see you when we get to the next day, which should be November 1st, I believe. I think I have it on four-day seasons. Okay, welcome back to November 1st. Uh, we are on our way out to get some feed mixed for the cows, because, as you can see, they are completely out. I think we still have all of our cows. Yeah, we, all, we still have them all in there, so... We're gonna get the tractor hooked up to... Well, actually, we're gonna get the silage bales and the hay bales mixing in the feed mixer and we'll hook this tractor up to the feed mixer after we put the silage bale in there uh, let's use let's use this one up first since it's a little bit smaller it should mix well with the other couple hay bales we have uh, we'll go to the other side since we Okay, and then we'll take a hay bale. I would grab that a little more realistically, but I really need to get these cows some food. We need to order some bales of straw, too. Or buy, purchase some. Okay, good. Worked out pretty well. It's a tight fit for this tractor in here. Okay. 
There we go. Gotta get this in here. And yeah, that should fill them up pretty good. And their health should go up as well. I'm a little worried about how much feed we're gonna have for the rest of winter. Because I don't think we're gonna have enough with what we have over there. So we might have to purchase some during the winter. Or while winter is here. I need to put that tractor away with a cedar or two. But I'm a little bit, a little bit concerned. I don't know if we'll have enough. I think I'm going to take the pickup truck and go check on the grass field we have down uh, in the trees back there and see if it's able to be cut again. Because if it is, I would like to bale it up. Um, I think we'll be good on hay, but I need silage because. If I can just feed them silage, if we run out of hay, I can just feed them silage. So I should have made more of that. I should have not used that other field for hay and done more silage, but... I don't think this one will be ready quite yet. Nope, it's not. Alright, well... I had a little hope. But that's okay. Next year we'll, uh... Well, actually, we might plant some more, uh, some more grass. Actually, I wonder if we can plant it this month so that it grows in the spring. We could plant, I think we could plant this field here. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. So we'll, let's see how much seed we have in the cedar there. Because if we have enough, we can go plant that field right now. Oh yeah, we got plenty. We'll just switch this over to, should we do... Grass or alfalfa? I feel like we could do alfalfa. Because I haven't done it for a while, and I'm kind of curious to see if it works. But we got to check first to make sure we can actually plant it this month. Doesn't look like it. Nope. We missed the window. October was our last window, so grass it is. We will switch this over to grass. We'll uh, plant this field. And I think we'll uh, probably do a time lapse of it, so we'll see you when we get done. That field is done. Should have grass popping up in there. And I think that's going to do it for today's episode. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, let's see if we can uh, get to 150 subscribers by the end of February. I think we can do it. We're at uh, 138 right now. So hopefully we can do it. I, I think we can. By the growth I've seen. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your day don't forget to hit the like button hit the subscribe button and leave a comment down below let me know what you think of the series i'm enjoying it so far we'll see you in the next episode peace <laughs>